everybody, I'm Michelle Carr. And I'm Matt Carr. And this is Riding in Cars with Cars Season 2. We're so excited to be back. <laughs> and uh, we're on our way to pick our first guest up. Yeah. It is Amit from Damn It Amit, That's Tasty. Food truck. Yes, a good food truck. And uh, we've known Amit for a number of years, but we want to learn more about him, how he got started with the food truck, and we want yeah. you to know more about him as well. And uh, we've got a cool event coming up we on do. Saturday that uh, both of us are a part of. Yep. So we'll talk a little bit about that as well. So stay tuned. Well, welcome to the car, Amit. Thank Riding you. in Cars with Cars, season two, your first episode of the season. So thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. <laughs> so Amit, one thing, you've been doing the food truck now. This is the end of your second year, correct? That's correct, yeah. Why did you decide to get into the food truck business, other than the fact that it's so damn good? <laughs> <laughs> well, to be honest with you, I obviously coming from the banking world and then changing careers. Well, that makes sense. Course, banking and, to the... Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Um, I just needed to do something on my own. I, oh, yeah, I, absolutely. Uh, and I needed to do something that I was passionate about. Mm -hmm. um, food comes very natural to me. Yes. I'm not a trained chef or anything like that but I do take pride in whatever I put out and whatever I present. So it became more of a, I'm working so hard for somebody else, why not work for myself and have the dividends pay back hopefully in the future? Obviously a higher risk, but yeah. it was something that I needed to do. And now that I'm doing it, it's been awesome. Yeah. It's been amazing. Awesome. The community has been a huge support, the business relations that I've created, the friendships I've created. You know, I would never have got that working at another restaurant or clubhouse or anywhere else. Emmett, what brought you guys to Airdrie in the first place? Because it's been, what, 16? 15 years. 15 years. Yeah, we were figuring that out last night, actually. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest with you, the one of the biggest reasons we moved here is real estate. Yeah. Uh, the housing market was a lot cheaper back then here. Mm -hmm. um, not that it's exploded everywhere now, but back then when we were looking at, we were 22 years old, 23 years old, trying to move out, trying to build ourselves up to be adults. And so we came over here and we always came out to Airdrie for dinners. We, you know, there was that one place that's now, um, I don't even remember it's called now, but it was Bambino's is it there now, but yep. before it was an Italian restaurant. Yep. And we Milano's saw, at one point. Yes, that's Milano's, it. Yeah. yeah. And we used to come out there on Friday nights for date night and have Aww. dinner there and stuff. And so we'd, you know, walk around the community, walk around Nose Creek, and we just really liked the community and the feel of it. Um, obviously, when we moved here, it was 20,000 people. Now we've grown to close to 70,000. Yes. So there's been a huge growth Huge, yeah. so and for me to be born and raised in Calgary and coming to Airdrie and seeing the tremendous growth that we've seen is just ecstatic because back when you're a kid seeing the growth in Calgary you don't realize that growth no. yeah. you don't get that growth right um, plus here biggest thing you can say hi to somebody and get a high back not a look not a who are you yeah not a you know so Emmett when you continue to refer to we you met you and your beautiful wife, Janine. Yes. Um, who is a major supporter of you and your business. I, I give her tons of credit because she works her nine to five job or actually probably 7.30 to six job, yep. Monday to Friday. <laughs> and then every Friday or Saturday, Sunday, she's working the food truck with you. That's correct. So yeah. how lucky are you? You know what? If there is anything to be thankful for, it is the fact that I have my wife in my life. If I didn't have her, I don't know where I'd be today. Yeah. And that's for honest to God. Anybody ask me that question, I am so thankful to have Janine as my partner yeah. in uh -huh. my relationship and in business. Yeah. Some people would think that, you know, we get sick of each other, but we actually do pretty good on the truck together. Yeah. yeah. Um, and which is awesome, but it's scary too. Because so. <laughs> <laughs> you get home and that's when the arguing starts. Exactly. <laughs> Not exactly. when you're cooking burgers and fries. <laughs> There's no point at that, that point. point, that just, point. <laughs> you take the money, I'll cook the food. Like, let's go. That's usually how it works. <laughs> and you guys, have, of course, have a little girl. Yes, Leia, who's the light of our life. Uh, we had her in 2013. She's five years old now. Started kindergarten. Okay, started kindergarten just today. Um, That's great. Yeah, and she keeps us grounded as mm -hmm. well as yeah. afloat at the same yeah, yeah. time, right? <laughs> she's always, yeah, she's just, uh, I can't describe how grateful we are to have her. Awesome. Yeah. That's great. So, Emmett, we always ask, what's your favorite song or what kind of music do you <laughs> like? And one of the things you listed was Bollywood music. So, yes, yes, that's what Matt and I did. Yep. 
Turn but, the light bulb. Yeah, turn the faucet. <laughs> turn the faucet. I can only do one at a time. I'm driving. Yeah. Here. Here's the thing. I didn't know what to download. So can you cue us up? Do you have some tunes on your uh, phone? I can. How's my Bollywood dancing? Oh, it's good. Yeah, you, you gotta go like this. Right. No, now you look like you're I'm stretching. doing the... Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh. Definitely it. Then get your shoulders first. Okay. Shoulders. Then you can get your fingers. It's hard to make him turn. When do we do the light bulb? Now. Anytime. So Emmett, this weekend is Airdrie Fest. So for anyone who's watching who doesn't know, it's a great opportunity to learn about different businesses and groups and kids events and activities. And it all happens down in front of City Hall uh, on Main Street. And you're gonna be there with the food truck. I am. I'm, yes. I'm lucky enough to be there both Music on Main on September 7th and then September 8th the whole day. So Music on Main is the Friday night event. Yes. That's going to be really cool. We've never done anything like this. No, and it's so exciting and it's going to be something that Airdrie really needed. Yeah. Anyway. yeah. So and I'm very excited about it. And then you'll be there Saturday. So what I'm hearing is I can eat from the food truck on Friday and Saturday. You got her. It's a two-day dab and Amit piece. That's a verse of it. That is a Bollywood dance. Tasty, tasty fish bites. Tasty fish oh, bites. Yeah. Tasty fish bites. You got, I got the classic burger. I got the smokestack burger. Yes. Uh, chili dogs, chili fries, jerky, pepperoni sticks. Nice. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. And on, on Friday night with Music on Main, they're actually doing beer gardens. They so are. Are you near the beer gardens? Because that's important. I believe I am. <laughs> okay. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, Aaron Prichette is the, uh, is the lead the performer on, on Friday night so that's yeah. awesome that they bring him in as well so one thing though I do want to thank you though Amit I you know we, we've got a booth with our Airdrie Angel program uh, and we we actually positioned it basically right across from you one we wanted to eat <laughs> two I'm, no sorry I gotta pause there we literally looked at the map and it said damn it Amit and I'm like, that booth's free. Let's take that one right across from it. Well, I really appreciate that. <laughs> well, but the other reason we, we said we wanted to do it was, or be beside you, is because we wanted to kind of team up and, and work together you on with something. And I called you and I said, hey, you know, let's get together and talk about it. And you just said, you know what? I would just like to donate 10% of my proceeds to the Airdrie Angel program. And that's good enough for me. That's right. And I wanted to say thank you for that because we wanted to yes. work with you and you decided to kind of work for us um, and we just we can't thank you enough you've been a huge supporter of the program in the past um, you know with Fitzsimmons you did a an event out there yes um, and again you're just you're just a you're just one of the great guys of the community and you're always looking to help the community and I just wanted to say thank you for that thank you very much Matt it's my pleasure honestly it's my pleasure to be working with you two as well as with the program that you guys have developed and has come so long from when I first started to where it is at today you guys should be very proud of what you oh, have thanks. done thank you yes well Emma thank you so much for joining us in the car today thank it was you. Uh, season great. two yes season two it was great to chat with you and I'm really excited about Airdrie Fest so Thank you for being a person in our community with amazing food and just being out there and feeding all of our Airdrie bellies. Thank you very much. I appreciate <laughs> you guys taking the time and having me on the season two grand opening special. Yeah, so <laughs> market, but where are you? Where can people find you? Um, the best place I recommend people to do is follow me on Facebook or Twitter or Instagram okay. um, at Dam and Amit Tasty. And from there, you'll see where I'm. I post every day where I am at. Okay. If I am out, if I don't have a post out, that means I'm not out. Though. Okay. Yeah. Now you've also been doing a thing with David Chef. Yes. And yes. that's going to kick up more probably in the winter time anyways, but it has. Yes, me I've had the uh, fortunate opportunity to work with Glenn Smaha there and uh, develop a small little kitchen which we are now serving lunches out for staff and we're going to be opening it up to the public. Nice. And uh, yeah, it's, When do you open it up to the public? Uh, Inquiring. Sorry, <laughs> eating minds want to know. <laughs> Let's just say come buy a truck and you can eat there anytime. <laughs> come come buy a truck. Oh, I'm, <laughs> yeah. I'm sure you can. Glenn, how did you like that little plug for David Chef? <laughs> oh yeah, buy the truck at David Chef. Yes, of course. <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> um, you know, we're we're hoping up to open that up to the public here right away. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. Well, I don't know how else to end this, but with more dancing. <laughs> here we go. Oh. 
slow at first? It's a little slow, yeah. I think you slowly put your arms up. Okay. Keep driving. I think I found my calling for dancing, Michelle. <laughs> I think you did too, honey. It's very good. In the show. <laughs> it's a body workout. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>